What's up guys? So in this video we're going to be talking about audio. Now, bad audio is one of the number one reasons somebody will click away from your film or your video. The three main things in any video is content, lighting, and audio. Not necessarily in that order, but you need to have these three things on lock in order to have a successful video. Recently I had an XLR cable give out on my shotgun mic. And if you're like me, you have a bunch of cables lying around. So I just grabbed one, plugged it in, and kept going. Now, little did I know that was a mono mic cable. And that wasn't an issue until I got it into Adobe Premiere. And I was realizing that I only had audio coming out of the left side of my speakers and the left side of my headphones. If you look at the jack of a mono cable and a stereo cable, they look different. The mono cable has one black stripe around the end and the stereo cable has two black stripes around the end. Here's a diagram here, check it out. You can see the different stripes on both. I mean, alternatively, if you look at the packaging before you buy the cables, it'll tell you mono or stereo. But me, like I said, I just reached into uh, one of my junk drawers, I had a bunch of cables, and I just used what I had. So, there is a fix around in Adobe Premiere, and I'm gonna show you guys that. It's kind of a quick hack. This is gonna be a quick video, so let's hop in real quick, and I'm gonna show you how to make your mono track sound stereo and play through both speakers and both headphones. All right, guys, so let's jump into Premiere, and let's check out how to do this hack really quick. All right, so if we play back this clip, Alright, so that was just a clip that when I put it in here is a mono track. So when you look at it and you look at the channels right here, you will see that only the left channel is uh, peaking up higher than the right. So how we're going to fix this is we are going to go down here, we're going to find our clip, we're going to right click it, we're going to go to modify audio channels, we're going to click that, and then we're going to go up here and it's already selected as stereo for us. If it's selected as mono, it's only gonna show one channel. You want it to be stereo. So when you select stereo, it's gonna have your left and your right uh, channel selected. Deselect your right. Make sure they're both on the same channel, like so. Hit OK. Now when we go through, you can see that both channels to the right are uh, spiking up equally. So let's play it and let's listen. Now when we apply that fix, now you guys are hearing me in stereo and I should be coming out of both speakers and both headphones. Sounds a lot better, doesn't it? And it All definitely right, sounds a lot better. So um, that is really a very simple way to fix that issue. Now the only thing that you have to remember is before you drag your clip onto your sequence, you want to make sure that you uh, right click it and you modify your audio channel. Because what will happen is if you try and do it after the fact, say you have um, a clip and you put a bunch of edits in it, you have it all cut up, um, and you just have something amazing, you can't go back and fix that audio channel um, after the fact. You need to modify it beforehand. That way, you don't have to go back and try and do that workaround for every single clip that you've chopped up. You just want to do it if, you know, from the very beginning and then it's good all the way through. So guys, that was a super quick tip. And if you guys enjoyed that, make sure you smash that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, comment, let me know if you know any other workarounds for audio. Um, if you enjoy these short videos, let me know guys. And remember, as always, just go shoot.